So yesterday a video came out of Andrew Tate's international lawyer saying the reason he wanted to fly to Dubai was because he had a doctor's appointment, right? He had an urgent doctor's appointment and I saw so many comments and so many people saying, oh no, it's BS, I call BS, he wants to fly away. No way, it's BS, he's a liar, this, that. And today, Andrew Tate's medical documents came out from Dubai, from his Dubai doctor. Let me read it for you. I am writing this letter in my capacity as Mr. Andrew Tate's primary care physician. I am a consultant in family medicine and medical director of King's College Hospital London in Dubai. Andrew is currently being investigated for a lesion in his right upper lung at King's College Hospital London in Dubai. He has recently undergone a contrast enhanced CT scan uh, on the 12th December 2022 where there were some concerning features of the lesion that require urgent investigation and tissue diagnosis. diagnosis. His case was discussed at our MDT meeting and he has been scheduled to have a number of further urgent investigations and procedures including a PET CT scan. Bronchoscop bronchoscopy and tissue sampling via CT guided biopsy. It is my professional medical recommendation that Andrew is urgently repatriated to the United Arab Emirates to undergo these medical investigations without delay. Time is of the essence and any further delay in the above investigation may have serious negative implication for Andrew Tate's physical health. So I've been reading a lot of people like if it's lung cancer, so this document, this document shows what they did and Basically, they they don't exactly know what it is, so it says it right here. The findings are non-specific. A differential diagnosis, including okay, there's too many big words. However, the size of the lesion, the satellite nodules, and infiltration infil, infiltrus, infil, infiltration of the surrounding tissues are finding suspicious for more aggressive neoplastic lesion. Basically, they're saying. We don't know. It's not. It's not specific, but it could be. A, it's a big chance it's a tumor, and tissue biopsy is recommended. So that's why he had to go back. Now I don't know what's gonna happen, right? This to me sounds serious. If it's lung cancer, like lung cancer, like from what I've read, obviously, like from being alive for 32 years, you keep hearing lung cancer is horrible. It's one of the worst ones, and I, it might, like, I don't. I don't think it could wait long. I don't think it could wait six months. That'll be death. No. So I don't know what the Romanian government is going to do. I have no clue. I have no clue. Like he hasn't been charged yet. Okay. So if, if I, have, I don't know if like I'm thinking that they have to let him go, right? They have to let him go to ch get this checked out. This isn't like a common flu. Oh, I have a cold. I need to get out or I have COVID or whatever. I need to get out. That's not, this isn't that. This is, this could be lung cancer and he has to get out to find out like immediately. That's what this document states. So. I don't know, man. In my opinion, this is 100% real. Like, I don't think, I, like, I know a lot of people are saying, oh, it's fake, it's fake, it's fake. Come on, man. Like, I, this is this is too much to fake. This is way too much to fake. So, let me know what you think of this in the comments, and it'll mean the world to me if you like and subscribe. And don't forget to hit the noting. Thank you.